we're at the end of the third elimination day of the Major League Fishing Challenge Cup, and we're on the winner's drive, and we have a hitchhiker today. It's uh, Takahiro Omori, who was the most successful guy. Congratulations, Tak. Good job. Yeah, thanks for having me. Caught uh, 20 fish for just over 34 pounds. So let's talk a little bit about the fishery that you were on, Bull Shows Lake. Um, it's, it's not a new lake to you. You've fished there before. We've had competitions there before. However, it's super high. Like, it is very high. So when you arrived there and you saw how high the water was, what was the first thing you thought of? You thought to yourself, here's what I need to do. What was that thing you needed to do? Usually, my basic idea, if it's a high water, you have to get to the bank to okay. fish it. Mm -hmm. Not like you have 100 yards to the bank it's like you know everything like a woods like you know you can't get to the fish mm. so you had a fish bank so how did you identify though which stretches of bank that you would fish I mean what what stood out to you as the places you needed to focus on well the way I find fish that kind of condition I had to go to like the back end of the creek okay. right. or back into the pocket or something again I want to get to the bank so it have to be either steeper or way, way in the back. What about like water clarity? Did that have anything to do with, with what you looked at? I was hoping some muddy water somewhere. Pretty much everything super clear, which I don't like kind of, kind of fishing. Mm -hmm. Right. But uh, sometimes if you get to the back of the creek, you can find little greenish, little, you know, little not off color, but a little darker mm -hmm. color water. That yep. makes a difference. So unlike the, the Bass Pro Tour competitions, which is how you qualified for this cup, no practice, you didn't have any idea where you were going. Do, do you prefer this or do you like a little practice? I like this format. For no information, no practice. Mm -hmm. Couple of reasons for that. That makes fair for everybody. Sure, sure. Plus practice on this level, I, I, I feel like you should be able to compete right away. It's like. I mean, if you practicing before the event on the same body of water, the, the fish will get kind of like beat it up mm. and the fish act different. Do you, uh, do you like the conditions that we have here this week? Do you think those suit you pretty well or no? Yeah, the usually high in the muddy water is kind of like my, my thing. So, you yeah, know? Yeah. I like it this way. All right, so yeah, there he is. He is, as we said, the, uh, the, the most successful elimination round three angler, Takahiro Mori. Next time you see him, we'll be in sudden death. Congratulations, buddy. Good job. Yeah, thanks for having me, though. Yeah, man.